Hey y'all, I'm Angie. Welcome to my channel where I do stuff. If you're new here, thank you for joining me. And if you're a returning subscriber, thanks for coming back. So in today's video, I'm going to be taking the agates that I found in the Big Bend region of Texas, and I'm going to be throwing them in a rock tumbler. Um, I have never done this before. I was gifted the rock tumbler and I'm pretty excited to get started. Um, but I kind of didn't plan ahead. And I mean, really, are any of y'all surprised? Um, so we're not going to have like a finished product at the end of this video, but I'm going to show you what it takes to get started, what I'm using, how to set up the tumbler, and yeah, um, let's get started. Okay, so here's kind of all the stuff and bathroom stuff, um, but uh, this is a Thomler's tumbler and uh, it comes with two small barrels and pretty good instructions and then i also got a uh, poly's plastic or poly plastics um tumbling media so i've got grit as well as uh, ceramic media if i wanted to use that um, both came with instructions so it talks about uh, the amount of grit to put in for the weight of what you're tumbling so this is going to take three tablespoons um, because it's by rock weight. This is just an empty barrel. And I am going to put in that step three, that's step one. So I'm gonna put three tablespoons of this into here. It said that it should be two thirds full, which it is. And um, yeah, so let me get this set up because uh, I'm just holding the camera right now. Let me get this set up and then I'll, I'll keep going through the steps. If you're enjoying today's video, please give it a thumbs up so you can appease the YouTube algorithm gods. Um, and anything you might want to know about the Tumblr, the products, all of my socials, my website, all of that, it's all in the description box below. Okay, so the first step is going to be to put the step one coarse grit into the barrel and it's going to take three tablespoons. Now I have all of this set up in my guest bathroom because this is going to run for at least a week um, before I move into the next stage. Now I have this set up in my spare bathroom because this is going to have to run for a week before I check on it and then uh, clean everything up and take a look at them. And um, so I, it absolutely has to be somewhere where I can't hear it. Um, so I've got, uh, I've got the tumbler on some rubber shelf liner and it's in a tray in case the water leaks for some reason, which it won't. But um, and then I have it on top of another two layers of uh, shelf liner to cut down on the vibration. Now I've done some trial runs with it and once I shut the bathroom door, um, I can't hear it from the bedroom or from my office. So uh, this is a perfect place for it really. Um, so it says that uh, I need to fill the barrel with enough water to just cover the rocks. So I'm gonna do that. Uh, I don't know if you can see in there or not. And then uh, I need to close it all up. So this is where it gets kind of difficult though um, for someone with fingernails. So uh, this has to go in here. And then the rubber O-ring goes around the outside. Yeah, so <laughs> like my nail polish, uh, this has been on for three weeks. I've been rock hounding for a week straight, washed my hands numerous times. Who knows what else I've done with these poor things. And the nail polish is still, you know, hanging on. And that's without even a base coat. So yeah, Simply Nail Logical's Hollow Taco. This is the uh, color shift. Um, I think it is in the shade Mist Shift. Yeah, anyway. Um, okay, so then I'm gonna turn it and make sure nothing leaks out. Yeah, 
All right, so then you just put it on the on the tumbler. This one doesn't have an on off button, so as soon as you plug it in, it starts. And that's it. So I'm gonna leave it for a week and uh, come back and check on it. Um, and I've gone through and kind of picked out uh, the ones that I thought might tumble well, and then I picked out the best of those that would actually fit in the barrel. I might have been able to fill up the other one as well, but I decided just to try one. So, all right, well, fingers crossed, and um, I guess we'll check on this next week. Well, y'all, that's all I got for you today. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. And if you did, then I hope you'll consider subscribing because I would really love to see you back here next week when I do more stuff. Bye.